I'm Matt. I am a research lead, and let's talk about SAM3D. SAM3D consists of two models, a special model for 3D human body reconstruction and a generic model for 3D object reconstruction. Humans have common sense. We were trying to bring this common sense understanding to 3D reconstruction. This is a problem that traditionally relied heavily on geometry. Unfortunately, it only gets you so far. Taking that final step to having a mature visual system relies heavily on recognition and prior knowledge of the structure of the world. They have been heavily optimized to solve the hardest problems, small objects, distant objects, heavily occluded objects, where traditional reconstruction fails. One technique that we adopted from large language models was preference optimization. This turned out to be an extremely powerful technique for capturing things like symmetry, which are difficult using traditional metrics. But using preference optimization, we can understand what humans are sensitive to. It works with a very small amount of data, and we found it extremely effective. We're one of the first to adopt these techniques in computer vision. We believe that this is the kind of model where when people see how robustly it works, we hope they'll find new applications that we haven't thought of. One that we're especially excited to roll out is on Facebook Marketplace, where buyers and sellers will be able to construct 3D models so they can see how products will look in their own space. In particular, though, we, we focused on applications like robotics. For example, helping robots navigate to objects and then interact with them. We're excited about the potential to create interactive 3D environments. Starting with 3D reconstruction of people and objects, we want to extend this to capture the scale and dynamics of entire 3D worlds.